Ah, there you go, friends. All right. Uh, well, and another day in paradise. And I know a while back, uh, just a few days ago, I uh, shot a video of the sun looking so orange. Honestly, it looked like a big old, uh, really warm navel orange up in the sky. And I was wondering what the heck was causing it. And, well, folks chimed, uh, well, they, they sent uh, information to me that it was probably smoke from the forest fires out in California. And now that I think about it, yeah, that smoke does get up into the, uh, I guess, the stratosphere, and uh, the jet stream brings it our way. Uh, it's, uh, and it's amazing how it can uh, spread and actually affect the color of the sun. Probably even a little bit, uh, the temperature of the sunlight hitting us, I would think. It would be like you're in the shade, right? Only it's, uh, it's smoke instead of leaves. Um, I know... Um, I was out in California, oh, what, about a year and a half ago, visiting my uh, son Burgess and his wife Claudia, new granddaughter Dora, and, uh, um, oh, Claudia's folks, and uh, had a great time. And they live uh, actually a little bit north of Los Angeles. And my, my son took, well, we all went out in the car and rode around looking at the, uh, you know, he wanted to show me the area. And, boy, the mountains are really... Uh, really high up and and yet people have homes somewhat on the top of the mountains up the side of the mountain i guess where else are you going to put a house I mean, it's it's all mountains <laughs> but the trouble is is there's this if i recall right he had a name for it it was some kind of vegetation that grows along the side of the mountain um much like we get uh, sticker bushes and such you know uh, here in in uh, new jersey in, in the east they they get some kind of brush uh, undergrowth that's uh, that grows right up the side of the mountain and gets dry, and eventually all it takes is uh, j just a little trash fire or something or a car fire or what have you, and or, or I guess sadly arsonists sometimes, and the uh, it just starts to spread, and uh, the uh, if the fire starts down at the at the base of a mountain. Next thing you know, it's rolling right up the top, and heaven help you trying to catch it. Number one, you don't want to be coming from above, from the top of the mountain, going down to meet the fire, because that fire is going to, yeah, it's going to, you're going to get cooked. Uh, so you got to chase it up the hill, and uh, that ain't so easy. I know I got in trouble as a forest fire. Uh, I was a, a sort of a beginning forest fire warden up in Pennsylvania. And I remember we got a fire, and I, I got kind of in trouble for positioning my men uh, to go down the hill to chase the fire. The, uh, I remember my uh, senior, um, well, my commanding warden officer um, said, why are, you, why are you going down to meet the fire? Don't you realize if your hoses go out, how are you going to outrun that fire when it's chasing you up the hill? I said, Gee, you got a point there. He said, I sure do. He says, what you do is you wait at the top of the hill. You've got a flat area there. When the, when the fire comes over the edge, you let it, you, you, you hit it with the water. And that'll, the, the, you've, lost the, uh, you've lost the slope. Get, the, uh, get where it comes, where it just crests the, uh, the hill or the mountain. And I guess, I, uh, trouble is in California, these mountains are all so steep. I don't know as you dare... Uh, you know, if if you try to go up to meet the the fire at the top of the mountain, uh, well, they, you you're just not going to be able to do it. And if, and worse yet, the fire might just creep around the other side of the mountain and be chasing you. And uh, it's 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 tough. I I guess they use a lot of airplanes and such to uh, uh, retard the fire. But boy, they got uh, when one starts in California, you got you got trouble. And uh, man. So anyway, I hope they're, uh, I, I hope all goes well for them. It's, uh, but you know, it's, it's funny. You see, uh, I, I know, I, I know we are riding along some area and a lot of it's fairly ritzy. A lot of folks have some mighty nice homes and they put them on top of the mountain, along the mountain, you know, the mountain slope. And I'm saying to Bur Burgess and Claudia, I said, well, gosh, why is someone putting a house there? Well, they, they just like the view and everything. Yeah, but I don't think I'd like the view of the fire coming up for them, you know, 
coming up to chase us. And uh, they, uh, Bert says, well, that's, that's what they do. And then they rebuild if it gets burned. I said, gee, you think you'd make the house out of bricks or something? I guess in some cases folks do, but others don't. And uh, yeah, you got you got trouble. You can get a lot of uh, um, yeah you you can get a lot of people injured in those darn fires. I know my daughter Sunshine uh, about when uh, she was married to her first husband uh, Matt. Uh, they got they got kind of mixed up in a forest fire, and it was all they could do to get out of uh, to get out of Dodge and to safety. The uh, Sunny said actually there was like tornadoes of fire uh, in in their neighborhood she said she says you can't believe it but it's like a tornado but it's flame and she says whoa scary and uh yeah so my my heart goes out to those folks out out west and and also water's kind of in short supply too uh they they don't have all the water on earth out there i don't know if they take the water from the ocean or not uh, I, I i honestly i don't know i, I would think that would work Salt water, fresh water, I don't think it would matter much to the fire. But, um, man. So anyway, yeah, it's, uh, it's quite, a, uh, uh, quite a puzzle uh, for them out there. And it's, uh, it's tough. So let's hope it all works out in our, and uh, give it a little time and our son will be back to normal. Uh, yeah, good old, yeah, <laughs> old Saul will be, uh, uh, will be nice and yellow again. And we won't have that orange that orange sun scaring the, uh, the heck out of us here in the, in the east. I, again, I hope it all works out soon. Bless their hearts. <sighs> yeah, I know. You know, for those folks out west, Lord's Prayer moment. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come. Thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, the power, and the glory for a, for a, forever. Bye now. Bye, friends. And we'll see you later. Again, I hope those folks uh, get a, maybe a, a little squirt of rain wouldn't hurt, huh? Yeah. Okay. We'll see you later. Bye now. God bless.